Welcome to a new year, and welcome to a new video. So, yeah, you guessed right. I'm talking about this again. So I have made a video about the Crow reboot, or remake, whatever the hell you want to call it. You know, a while back. Back in the old, older days, when I was in my blue room. So pretty much, if you want to look back at that video, or hear my thoughts of the project earlier. It's called, What's the Point of Rebooting the Crow? Yeah. So go check that video out. It's my old self. And just check it out. Now, let's just ask the big question. What the hell is going on with the Crow reboot? Or remake? Or whatever. Now, yes. If you guys are wondering, I'm a big fan of the first Crow movie. I love it. I watch it every Halloween. Or once in a while if I feel like popping in something that's really good from the 90s. So, another thing I'd like to also mention, my short film will also be released on, i say the beginning, uh, okay, maybe on next Wednesday. So there will not be a trailer for that, but yeah, next Wednesday you'll get my short film for next week. So either way, you look forward for that. Now, enough of that being said. Now, this movie has gotten tons of actors who are have, how you say, you have actors who really have good premise. Good promise, I mean. So, let me show you the pictures of the actors who've turned down the role of the crow until we have now, they've gotten... Jason Samoa to play as the crow. So play it out on that list. Mm hmm. I'm not gonna lie. She has the nicest rack I've ever seen in my entire life. So if you look down the list, that's a long, long good list of good actors who turned down the crow. I'm not even joking. Now yeah, there was a rumor saying that they were going to get Jason Statham to play as the crow, and they were considering getting Nicholas Holt to play as the crow also. But here's my issue. These actors have good, good, are good actors. Why they turn down playing the crow? Why? Now, here's my theories. Two of them. Now, theory number one. Now, it could be that the actors respect Brendan Lee's crow. And they consider it as a, well, a really good, great film. They probably, probably, you know, they thought, hey, Brendan Lee made that movie work, so that movie was good, so why would I have to add my acting in the film? Now, also, second theory. The script must be so fucking bad. The script must be so bad that it actually is going to be a terrible movie. I have three words for you. Foot in the ass. And you probably have three words. Probably have five words for me. Got cheap ass directors. Got cheap ass directors. Okay, that's four words, but either way, could it be that the movie might not be good because they're rebooting something that's already good? Now, yes, they couldn't continue on with the Crow sequels, even though they went sterly, sterly bad, but for one thing, could it be that these actors respect Brendan Lee's Crow and don't want to ruin it 
for the new generation. Now, of course, many people go, grow up saying, why would I want to watch The Crow when I can watch it at home for free? Now, yeah, that's true. But one thing, I'm just like, now my hopes for this movie to be suck. You're actually right. I am hoping for this movie to suck. And I am hoping this movie might be better than the sequels. Because, honestly, the Crow sequels have not been good. At all. Zilch. Been shitty. <sighs> Excuse me. But for one thing, I look forward for this, this movie. Depending what Samoa will do, or depending what the director will do. Now, if the movie is bad, I will totally make a video on it. If the movie is good, well, I might make some type of video. But until then, The Crow Reboot, or Remake, or as it's called, The Crow Reborn. There will be a video for this, hopefully. But, we all agree for one thing. The original director who did The Crow is totally against this film. Completely. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's actually kind of true. Yeah, definitely. So, with that said, that's another video. A new video, a new year. So, don't, don't worry, guys. I'm going to make more Vertical Spy videos, you know, for this year. And hopefully, there won't be the usual videos of me making my short films. But for one thing, we're going to have some fun this year. Even though I'm turning 30 years old. So, till then, Vertical Spy, outro.